जय राधा मोहाना जय कुंजा बिहारी गोपी जान वाल गिरीवरधारी शोर नंदन व्रज जान रंजन यमुन चिरावन चारी रासा कुंजाबी मम ज्ञान चिमीरंदनंजना शलाखा चक्षुरुन्मीठा ये नस्तमा श्री गुरव नम गुरव नम गुरव नम गुरव नम जय राधा मोहना कुंजा बिहारी गोपी जान वाल नंदना व्रज जान रंजना यमुन चिरावन चारी रास कुंज भी हारी राधा मोहना कुंजा बिहारी गोपी जान वाल गिरीवरधारी शोर नंदन व्रज जान रंजन यमुन चिरा वन चारी रास कुंज भी हारी ज्ञानाजनाशलाकाय चक्षुरुन मिलिठम ये नस्म श्री नम मम ज्ञानाजनाशलाकाय चक्षुरुन्मीठम ये नस्म श्री गुरव नम जय राधा रास मोहना जय कुंज बिहारी आगपी जान वाल गिरीवरधारी शोर नंदन व्रज जान रंजन यमुन चिधावन चारी रास कुंज बिहारी जय राधा मोहन कुंज बिहारी जान वाल गिरीवरधारी शोर नंदन व्रज जान रंजन यमुन चिरावन चारी रास कुंज बिहार
So you cannot see me. Jai Radhe. Radhe. Jai Sri Radhe. My obeisances to all of you, to Guru Dev, to all Radha Dasi. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, Madhuri, for always giving us such a heartwarming and soft entrance into the international sharing here. Thank you, thank you. So, Radhe Radhe, all brothers and sisters, all Dasis, Radha Mahan, Radhe Radhe, Sharanagati is also here from Italy. And Shringar Das. Jai Ho, Kevala Bhakti, and Maharas is here, and Kishori Didi, and Sundara. My God, I'm so happy to see you all. <laughs> Thank you for coming and opening your hearts without fear, without shame. Gurudev always says there is no guilt and no shame in Raga Bhakti. So we try to practice this here. In our little ways to make Gurudev happy, to make happy to all the Vaishnavas that we can feel strong together. So Kishori Dasi, you have one surprise today. Dadi Radhe. Yes. We are always in surprise. Every moment is a surprise. <laughs> Sorry, which kind of surprise? Please inspire me. <laughs> the surprise of Maharas is coming to sing and share. <laughs> Thank you for inspiring me. <laughs> Maharasa Didi. Rade Rade. Rade Rade. So thank you for every time. So today, Janana Maharaj recommend to the, uh, for Mahara Sadasi to share her life experience and uh, maybe many Japanese devotees know Mahara Sadasi is good for Kirtan. So she's always playing nice Kirtan in Japan Puja also. And today, so Suniti Didi makes her <laughs> some order, uh, some order or some request, let's say request to the Bajan. Like uh, Elda Manjari says, please, some kirtan for our Swamini, like this mood, I feel it. And uh, I'm very proud of her. Such a nice request she got. So sounds nice. And uh, now she's learning kirtan from senior Vaishnavas, like Asuniti Didi also, and the Kaprad also. And of course, our Guru Dev Jananda Maharaj also. She's a very fortune soul. So, Maharasa Didi, so uh, let's start singing or from first some comments, then sing. How do you feel? Shakini Choto Hanashi Shimaska Sugutai Maska. Nade Rade. Nade Rade. あの、何かお話しされてご挨拶されてから歌いますか。ちょっと僕の紹介とかそれともすぐ歌いますか。えっと、どちらでも。まずゆらい。はい。じゃあ、歌います。そう、スニティディディのシーズレディ、リトルバ
<laughs> Wonderful, Maharas. Wow. Suniti and Andaka san no jihi desu. Bye, Suniti Didi Mercy and Andaka san, Andaka Jizu Mercy. Tenbu Suniti san to Andaka san ni narayimashita. This music ran from all Suniti Didi and Andaka Ji. <laughs> Beautiful. Tsukushi desu. Jaiho. Jainanda Maharaj is very happy. All Vaishnavas happy and Gurudev is also happy. <laughs> so my request, my humble request. So here, and Gorabaniji is here. And he's a very good kirtanist, everyone knows. And Madriji is also here. So please blessing her kirtan more nicely. Now is very nice and give blessing from senior Vaishnava, please. Some <laughs> comments, please, for her blessing, please. We respect you. <laughs> yes, Madhuri is a wonderful singer and uh, I'm sure that he will sing something very nice. <laughs> no, they want blessings from you for Maharaj. Dasi, give some nice blessings that she can become a real, real deep-hearted Kirtania lady. Well, all blessings I have are coming from Gurudev, and I think Gurudev is giving her blessings. So, also, my blessings are formally not needed. You will have it anyway. In the name of Gurudev. <laughs> No, 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 no. We need your blessing, Gorabani. <laughs> we need your blessings, Jayananda Maharaj. Please, Gorabani. If, if, if you bless, when you bless her, she will anyway grow like uh, the fastest tree in the universe. But all blessings from all Vaishnavas, which blessed me also to you, I'm sharing. Thank you. I was so happy to hear you singing, really. Thank you very much. It is a blessing when you sing. And uh, so I hope you get consciousness to, to, to be always in, in the vibration of love together when you're singing, because we can feel it when you sing. And so... Really, thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Maharaso san, nani ka o hanashi o kattara, eigo demo, nihongo demo. Arigato gozaimasu, hongo demo, shoto. Arigato gozaimasu, nishio, arigato gozaimasu. Thank you very much, both of your mercy. Thank you so much. I need your mercy from all of you. <laughs> <laughs> that I can do such a seva. And um, so I can learn from, from the heart, from everybody. Thank you very much. And again, thank you very much, Suniti Didi, because so by Jananda Maharaj's mercy, now Japan is like this growing, but uh, you know, our history is very still young, not so much long time. So by this Zoom meeting, we can get mercy from senior Vaishnavas from all over the world, especially Rashikas. Thank you so much again and again. Beautiful. So Maharas wants to share something, Kishori Dasi, also about her life in Bhakti and her history, her, her feelings. Yes. Maharasa-san, お話しできそうですか? Yes, she's a very nice experience. But so she's very shy. I don't know how much she can share today, but so maybe she sees, <laughs> she try her best. お願いします. あの、シェアさせていただきます。アンナさんよろしくお願いします。
。あ、アナさん通訳されますかあ、キシャリーさんですかわかんないです。ごめん。アンナさん、副音声に入ってるんで、私の方でメインで。あ、わかりました。ありがとうございます。えっと、えっと、私が、あの、一番最初に、えっと、ジャナンダ・マハラージにお会いしたのが、2018年の2月です。ファーストタイム、リトルリトル。ファーストタイム、アイメットジャナンダ・マハラージ。Um, in, in 2018 February. でその時にあのバクティマーバクティ・イマギリ先生のところでジャナンダ・マハラージが講座をされていてでそこであの初めてお会いすることになりました。At that time? マンバクティヒマギリディーディーオーガナイズズジャーナンダマハラージーズシェアリングインハヨガセンター I was joined I was be I was there then by this occasion I can I could meet ジャーナンダマハラージ first time でその時にあのどうしてそういうふうにあの先生を探していったのかっていうと、その、当時すごく慕っていた、尊敬していたヨガの先生と、あの、うまくいかなくなったんですね。At that time, I was searching real yoga teacher because I did yoga at that time also, but at that time, some reason, I didn't make nice relationship with that yoga teacher. それで、あの、どうやってこの先そのヨガを続けていったらよいかっていうことがもう全くわからなくなってしまい、で、そのヨガのお師匠さんというか、まあ、すごく慕っていた先生とヨガの道をこう失ったみたいな状態でいました。At that time, I was totally lost the way because this yoga teacher and I had a very nice intimacy relationship before, but for some reason this relationship was not good and means I really totally lost the way of yoga. That's why I was very confused at that time. その時に、あの、今桐先生のスタジオに、その、ジャヤナンダ・モハラージがきいらっしゃっていて、えっ、ー、と、初めてお会いして、えっ、ー、と、たくさん他にも生徒さんというか、その、講座を聞きにいらしてたんですけど、えっ、ー、と、今桐先生と、ヨギーニ先生がその時、すごく、あの優しく受け入れて、招き入れてくれたので、安心して、ジャナダマハラジとお話ししたのを覚えています。うん、This class for me first time, but、uh, プレマヨギニディリー and マーバクティヒマギリディリー kindly accepted me and I, feel, I felt some peace And、uh, I could talk with Jayananda Maharaj. I remember it still now. でもちろん、ヒョリさんも一緒にあのいらっしゃったので、一緒に受け入れていただきました。Of course, キショリ was there also. She also accepted me kindly. これで、えっと、そ,うね、そのちょっと戻るんですけれどその時すでに、えー、っとこう感情を抑えるようなお薬を飲んで何年か経っていたんですね。Oh. At, uh, these days,、uh, at that days, at that days, 
I have used to took medicine, mental medicine, to keep my emotion, control my emotion medicine. Yeah. 確か多分あの2011年頃にその不安が強すぎてそのパニックみたいになってそれでもうお薬飲まないといられないような感じになってやっぱり私も家族もすごく苦しみました。From 2011, I started to take this Mind control medicine. Then I and my family felt so nervous and suffer. Maybe for seven years, I took this mind mental medicine to keep my normal panic syndrome. それでジャヤナンダ・マハラージにお会いしてマントラを教えていただいてえっ、ー、とバガバット・ギーターその当時えっ、ー、と講座で教えていただいてで他にもたくさん教えていただきながらそのベジタリアンになって1年間Mm. Then I started to chant Maha Mantra, giving by Jayananda Maharaj for one year. And I learned another things also, and Bhagavad Gita also. And I slowly, slowly became vegetarian. ベジになったのとマントラ1年で、あの、吸っても忘れるようにやめられたのがすごくびっくりしました。After one year from I started to chant Maha Mantra and become vegetarian, I could quit this medicine, which I thought I had to take for all life. It was so surprised to me. それで、あの、バクティとかマントラってすごいなって、自分ももちろん家族も周りの人も、みんなこう幸せにハッピーに生きる方法なんだなっていうのがこう実感できました。Then I got a realization. This Maha Mantra is real solution to live happy not only for me, But also my family and my neighbors and around myself people. それから2019年にそのジャーナンダ・マハラージがサドゥ・マハラージのところに連れて行ってくださってブインダーバンにフンゲルマンディールにあの行くことができました。2019 Jananda Maharaj introduced Mungel Mandir and、uh, I could,、uh, I could go Mungel Mandir in 2019 and I met Sadhu Maharaj. でその時に、えっ、ー、と、Sadhu Maharaj にお会いした時に、えっ、ー、と、夫のことをちょっと相談しました。When I met Sadhu Maharaj, I asked about my husband. で当時、その夫はあの仕事上の,その試験が毎年あって、えっと、それをすごくすごく頑張っていたんですね。At that time, he had to go through one exam. Which is for his business very important and difficult one, and he hardly prepared to go through it. でもこう本当にこう簡単ではない試験で夫もその与えられたもの平等にその与えられたものなので
こう、最後までパスしたいっていう、その強い気持ちで、何年も何年も頑張っていたんですけど、その、やっぱりすごく辛そうだったので、何かサポートできることが私にあるでしょうかっていうあのご質問をサブマハラジにさせていただきましたそう、It's really very difficult exam to pass and from my side my husband felt some suffer or some hardly time that's why I asked サブマハラジ What can I do? To support him. サトゥマハラージの,あのお答えがあの、次に受かるよと。ただ、そのジャーナンダ・マハラージにちゃんとお会いして、お話を聞いてあの、進むのがベストですよというあのアドバイスをいただきました。At that time, サトゥマハラージ said, Next time, he will pass. This exam. But he n e e d to meet Jananda Maharaj and listen his、uh, word. で、えっと、私だけがそのマントラを唱えたり、講座に行ったりしていたので、えっと、そんなにこう、会う機会はなかったんですね。で夫とジャナンダ・マハラジが。Before I went to Janana Maharaj's class and reading books is only alone, only by myself. That's why my husband didn't have so much occasion to meet Janana Maharaj. でもある時、そのジャーナンダ・マハラジは私の,あの家の近く、えっと、お家のエリアで講座をしてくださった時に彼を合わせることができました。で、私のために会ってくれたと思います。But one day he came near our home to give class.At that time, We can get a chance to meet Jananda Maharaj.、Uh, my husband get a chance to meet Jananda Maharaj. I think maybe Jananda Maharaj met him for me. えっと、Jananda Maharaj はその夫の心にすごくあの寄り添って、こう、親身に。すごく真剣にお話をずっとしてくださって。At that time, Jananda Maharaj seriously listened to my husband's story and sincerely and console him very, what to say, treat nicely with him. で、たくさんのそのアドバイスや応援をくださいました。And he gave me,、uh, he gave him very cheerful word and some blessings for him. ジャーナンダ・マハラジはすごく博学なのでの、この試験をパスするっていうバクティックちょっとまた別のお話。で、この実生活に即したような、その内容でも、すごくこう、細かい、えっ、ー、と、アドバイスをいつもくださいます。で、それを、あの、夫にもくださいました。You know, Jananda Maharaj is a very experienced person in this material life also, and very genius person also. That's why that time, ジャナダ・マハラージ give very effective advice for him how to pass this exam. もうそれからですね、えっと、この次第に、えー、うちにそのジャナンダ・マハラジとカラバッティさんからいただいた二体ゴーラがいるんですけれどもその二体ゴーラにこう旦那さんが夫があの
、ダンダバットするようになったんですね。えっと、スローリースローリー、マイハズバンド、スターティッド、ダンダバット、トゥ、ニタイゴーラ。And this ニタイゴーラ、I took over from ジャーナムのマハラージエンドカラバティディディ。で、それを多分数ヶ月、あの、旦那さんは続けて、で、その、ジャナンダマハージも何も変えなくていいから、マントラを、その生活に毎日唱えてね、っていう、あの、すごく大事なアドバイスをくださって、あの、多分マントラとダンダバットをずっと、その試験まで、試験までというか、その、特に、あの、実践したと思います。And actually, so he kept,、uh, he kept this dandabat every day and chant mantra until this exam day. And Janana Maharaj said, you don't need to change anything, but just keep chant maha mantra in your life. Then he kept this dandabat、uh, and, and this chant maha mantra. So, 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 すごいもう並々ならぬ寝ないで勉強するというそのスタイルがもう実ったグルデーブと二体ゴーラとラーダモーハンの慈悲で実ったと思っています。And finally, in this month, he got past this exam after long years. Of course, he made effort for a long time, not sleeping like this, very hard studying. But actually, I felt this is just, this is by mercy of Gurudev, Radha Mohan, and Nitai Gora. Jayananda Maharaj, I was able to do it, and I was able to do it, and I was able to do it. And I told the result when I told the result. ジャナダマハラージ become so happy because this exam is only 1.5% can get go through. That's why he became so happy. And I thought actually like this, this exam is very, very, very difficult, but、uh, he could make effort like this. Only this make effort without mercy is impossible. なのでその普通のえっと普通の生活の中のことをうんことも全部やっぱりこう慈悲で成り立っているということをすごく感じてもちろん自分たちの努力は大事だと思うんですけれどもあのすごく守っていただいているなっていう守り守っていただきながらこう、うん、ハッピーな方向にその家族や周りの人がこう一緒になって進んでいけるんだなっていうことをあの知りました。From this Experience, I realized that we can make effort, but without mercy, even though we cannot make effort like this, every small lifestyle, life, every small daily life things 
Without mercy, impossible means everything is mercy in this daily life also. And means we are always secure and protected. And uh, so like this, then uh, I feel very secure and protected. Means Rada always give us the way to become happy. で,で、私たちは、その、なんか、あの、すごく難しい試験にパスしたりとかっていうことが、こう、普通に起こるような、あの、人たちではないと思っているので、やっぱり、あのラダモハンの慈悲深さ、グルデーブの慈悲深さを感じました。そう、アクチャリー、ウィソート、アワファミリーイズノットソーマッチスペシャル。That's why normally it's impossible to get this result to pass exam. Without mercy, it's impossible means only by Radha Mohan's mercy、uh, we can get this result. This is my real feeling. でこうやってあのキルタンをスニーティーさんに習えたり、アンダカさんに習えたり。世界中のそのシニアのディボーティーの方とお会いできたり、サデマハラジにお会いできたりするのはもう本当にジャーナンダマハラジの慈悲でしかないので、いつもありがとうございます。全部グルクリッパーです。Everything is just グルクリッパー。I can learn. Kirtan from Suniti Didi and Andakaji, and、uh, I can get associated like these nice Vaishnavas and senior devotees. Everything is just all come from the mercy from Jananda Maharaj. The Nihon no sono devotee no, Nina san to ishoni, a no, ima. いろんなお話をジャーナンダ・マハラジから、サズ・マハラジから、シニアの皆さんから聞けるっていう、そのすごくラッキーな、すごく幸せなことも本当に全部グルクリパです。ありがとうございます。This also グルクリパ that I can,、um, I can get the chance to listen ジャーナダマハラジーズハリカタ、with Japanese devotees, and like this, just listening with my friends, Japanese friend, it's real my fortune, and thank you very much. ありがとうございます、ラベラベ。<笑>
all everything coming in flow and very smooth and very smoothly going on. That that's I think this is Vaishnava Kuripa, Guru Kuripa and Radha Mohan's Kuripa. And uh, so and now I really <coughs> I also uh, recommend Suniti Didi to teach us because her song is so sweet and so devotional and everybody who join her class, Suniti Didi's class, everybody is happy and also and uh, now uh, Gorabani and uh, Madhuri and um, like Madhuri Pabu and other senior devotees also singing and uh, we also learn it. Also we can, we could learn their feeling, Baba. So, and uh, I, I pray uh, her, uh, she can, she could advance more and more and uh, she could serve as a Vaishnavas and uh, Nittai Gora and Radha Mohanji and also Gurudev. So, and uh, she, her family also become more devoted to Radha Mohan. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. So heartwarming to hear all of your voices, which are filled with so many experiences. How love of the Vaishnavas, of Gurudev, is all helping to get away from the blockage, to come out of the darkness and to come into the light, to come into the soul level and to come finally to our Dasi Bhav of Shrimati Radhika. And Gorni Thai are so merciful. They are the most merciful and they are the savior of all people in this Kali Yuga. So thank you for your witness. You are witnessing this, you are experiencing this, and you are feeling and sharing it. Thank you so much. Sniti Didi, I would like to add one point of her uh, aspect. How to yes. get it. Thank you. So Maharasa Dashi have Namahata program every month. Every month, Andakazi and uh, I went her home and maybe 20, 30 people gathering her home. And uh, first she made prasadam alone. But the uh, first time, two, three people, everyone have this uh, kind of experience. But now this many big number, maybe Nitai Gora and uh, her love catch people. <laughs> Then many friends enjoying kirtan and harikata and after that helping cooking. Now she never become alone. And this, <laughs> I think, so this, so Nitai Gora went to her home means Nitai arranged her namahata. And I see how namahata is activated. Like this, her family, Jana Namahara just said, her, all her family's problems gone. How Namahata is uh, nice. And, uh, and Sadhu Maharaji often said, so Japanese people are just monk, alone, isolated, no relationship. But this Namahata, it's very active in Japan, many, many occasions I, I witnessed. This is also... Jai. Big important point. I learned many things from Mahadasa Dachi. She's one of my best friends. Thank you wow. very much. Thank you so much for sharing and caring and loving each other so much. You are giving us also deep feelings through your sharing. Thank you. Now I would like to ask a uh, Kalindi Didi from Switzerland to share something about her service and her feelings in her service. I know her many, many years now and she, when Gurudev was traveling in Europe, 
She always would do his tickets and arranging the programs. And also her house would always become full of Vaishnavas. And now she's also doing so beautiful service. Kalindi Didi, welcome. <laughs> hey, Karin. Rade, Rade. Rade. Rade, Rade. Well, my God, brothers and God, sisters, dear Maharaj, Rade, Rade. So Suniti asked me to speak. I don't know much what to say. Um, I was thinking maybe to tell you my, my life story, uh, which is going through many phases. So I was born in a in a very Catholic family in '65, and uh, at that time it was a uh, we used to go to church every week. So for me it was just normal. It was just uh, it was not many kids. They didn't like to go because they felt it boring. And also later on in my teen in a teenager age, always I was I knew there is God. And uh, but I was not with Catholic Church. Uh, um, I felt not comfortable anymore because many things I I could not understand. And then I discovered. Imagine I discovered when I was nineteen by books. I discovered there is a reincarnation, and I said, "Wow, this makes sense." So uh, there was. I had some feeling in in searching. There is something more. This material world is is not is it, 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 it's not that it's not the the final destination it's it's there is something more and um it took me 20 years many faces were there i had one boyfriend for example he was a very very materialistic person so <laughs> i remember he was always telling me you need a goal you need like some nice car or vacation or house or whatever to work for it I was thinking, I'm not, I'm really not interested in having a nice car. This was not for me a goal which um, I would, would work or longing for it. So then the years passed by and was even, I met um, devotees in Switzerland. Uh, they were very active. They were selling books. I had books at home, piles of books. And even when, when I, I married my now ex-husband, <laughs> I even we had a devotee cooking for us and we even exchanged garlands at our wedding day. But somehow I was also in his seminar, but somehow at that time still I was I was always looking forward to something else in so many seminars, esoterical seminars and books and whatever. The time was not ready. I was I felt it, oh it's nice and uh, but somehow it was not um, I you say the click was not done at that time. So then I gave birth to my children, two wonderful children. And when I was 39, I, by chance, okay, chance, <laughs> in the street, I got some books uh, from some devotee. And when I was reading this book, it was just, I was just overwhelmed and just fall in love with, with, this, with Krishna, with his philosophy. And I just felt, wow, after 20 years, is it really, I couldn't believe in the beginning, did I really arrive now? Did I re is this really what I was looking for 20 years? And I couldn't believe in the beginning. Um, what to say? So I started to go temple. I met the devotees. And very, very soon I met also Gurudev. But <laughs> like <laughs> it looks like that it, everything takes time in my life. <laughs> um, I um I was not like oh, some day telling, oh, they saw Guru Dev and they were falling in love and just knew that they arrived. For me, it took time. It was developing. So my relationship with Guru Dev developed to 2007. First, I went to Brindavan. I did not know what to do there. What, 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 what I, I was just there and went there many years for one, two times a year. But then I was listening to Guru Dev over all these years, and and finally, I really felt, wow, yes, this is really my place with him. This is really what I want. This this Radha Dasyam, this this I belong to the feet of Radharani. This is really my place, definitely. And it's kind of I say it, it's always it's kind of I put an anchor, but the rope is more. <laughs> Always still very loose. I'm still, 
floating in this material world and looking for enjoyment and and distraction and but still there is still something there and i i see all of you how eager you are how wow determined you are then i feel still i feel like the smallest of you like a very small beginner of of um having the desire to have more greed and and but somehow uh i know i have faith uh, so much then i have to connect with the faith that's what like guru dev always says faith there is hope and goes to comes to love and this keeps me keeps me alive and keeps me going on so this is a little bit what how I experience my life life story now some some years ago we were in Vrindavan my partner and I in, in 2017 and there was the pre medical seva there and he gurudev he wanted to stop it and then we decided that we will continue with it and now we are trying to sponsor this uh, seva and uh, as some of you know them as this is now the second year that Guru Devi gave me blessing to do the calendar. I know in Japanese, Japan you also have very nice calendar, but if ever you like, <laughs> or if someone on here likes, they can contact me. So this year, uh, last year was the calendar with all the sevas and all the uh, Mungurmandir, and this year will be all um, darshans of Radha Mohan. And I'm very, very happy to do this seva. It's really at least because many years, yes, I was organizing Guru Dev's tour and also Bhakti festivals. And really to have this seva is, is very important for me. Um, what more can I say? <laughs> so, so my experience is just, yeah, it, 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 it has to be the right moment. I don't know somehow we can... Yeah, I was I was having this loaning for twenty years, and even had contact with devotees before, but somehow the quality of the moment has to be, or the mercy when mercy is coming, then the things happen. And one more thing, but still, what's still happening in my life is still that I'm also struggling with my anger and my anartas. And what what I feel it's very important that to become in peace and in love and in forgiveness with oneself. This was Maduri with uh, helping me so much. We had three time. He came eight hundred kilometers from his place to my place. We had wonderful Ho'oponopono seminar here in my house, and this helps me so much that really not to judge me anymore, to, to struggle so much with myself anymore. That is not so easy sometimes with myself. <laughs> and uh, also in my, in my spiritual life, not to, to, to touch me. Judge me means I couldn't do much more. I could read more. I could chant more. I have plenty of time. But somehow I miss the taste or it's, it's somehow, I don't know, it's, it's like it is, but not to not to to judge me uh, with, uh, with this, and but to 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 get in love and to hug myself and to see I'm a human being and and everyone as well. <laughs> rade, rade. Thank you, Kalindi. You are so. Such a jewel in Gurudev's garland that he will hang on the neck of Shimate Radhika. Mm -hmm. And I always appreciate so much how you how you are you are you have this feeling to bring everyone together. And the Gurudev always says Kalindi Ma. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's why, because you have such a motherly heart to bring everyone together and to always meet and you always want to organize festivals. And now the last two years, it was difficult because of the virus war. <laughs> Let's say it like this. It becomes more crazy now again. It's a kind of a, you know, difficult situation where we cannot meet like we could before. 
But uh, I know Kalindi is always eager and she writes mails and she says, let's meet again for the prayer mailer. And you're always enthusiastic. And I really, really love this about you, how you are so positive, enthusiastic, even in the midst of difficulties and in the midst of uh, somehow depression when we cannot meet in the long distance travels. But you are always, always happy. And I know we love this. We all love this it's about you, good with with for all our heart and good if also. No. I also want to say something. No. Oh, Guru Dev, brother, Radha, please. Is my mother? Why I say ma? Because mother always careful, so she become angry with love. So her love is is coming sometime with angerness, and I like that. Love, <laughs> <laughs> One thing, second thing, when I start going to the door, Mela, so, Chris Chandra and Kalindi was there to start and organize everything. Mm. Savan Alpals and it was very good, very good program she organized. And after that she organized my old plane tickets mm. from the whole world. It's not easy. And because she made my program so Indian person become German because I cannot change for two hours that I'm a card and speaker. <laughs> My car becomes not good. So I have to be there because Mama Kalin the program is there. So I have to follow very seriously. <laughs> so India become German practice. <laughs> so this is her quality. Mm -hmm. She makes me totally in time. Third thing, she is doing payment is a surprising thing. And payment in Karna time when they are dying in India. <coughs> It was so big boon for the person who is dying. And this was the only hope for him because they cannot go to hospital even. And I am surprised of this doctor. He was boldly helping to the corona patient. So I have to make separate place that other not become affected. Other way, after that, you can imagine in morning eight to nine, ten. If you want to cross the outside to from the temple to outside, so much motorcycle and scooter they bring inside. Dark patients that you cannot go out. <laughs> it takes 15 minutes to make it clean. The car can come and somebody can come in and out. It's so heavy, heavy so, uh, service is going on and see the reason. And one thing I say, how she collect the funding for that she make the ladu and she herself go to Switzerland market to collect the money. She herself doing this, collecting money by selling sweet for Shadow. So she is really great. Great. And I see the calendar, what she makes. Every month, Basanta Panjami, like January, she made the, that time picture. 
फरवरी मार्च इतना झूला ना होली सो ही मैं होली फेस्टिवल महादेव राधा मोहन सिंगार एंड यू कैन फील बाय दर्शन ऑफ राधा मोहन बीच फेस्टिवल दिस सो इट्स रियली ब्यूटीफुल कैलेंडर सी मैं थैंक यू कैलेंडर I appreciate, and you see, he did think once. I cannot go to Europe. So how to combine the devotees and to so she start traveling and visiting to the home of devotees, where nobody is going, and she sharing, staying there, and you know. Very, very it's night time. Sleep in her car, where and then she meet with the devotees. She never give any burden to the any devotees. Mm-hmm. Special qualities, full of special qualities. Mm-hmm. And I say, what you are, live like this, and now she become grandmother. She has to more big face to us. She is hiding him. <laughs> Radhe Radhe. <laughs> Radhe Radhe. Oh, one thing I have to tell you, my dear co brothers and sisters. Finally, actually, I could not escape from Guru. <laughs> When I met him first, it was like sixteen years ago, uh, around. So he was already traveling in Switzerland because I met him here in Switzerland. When Krishna Chandra invited him, and then he was traveling in Switzerland. I was not initiated that time. Two time, he asked the one who is touring with him to stop in my place because he wanted to see me, or and also maybe also he wanted to to touch my ex husband, but he would not. He did not allow. It. So <laughs> you see, <laughs> I was not. I was not uh, able to. <laughs> Escape from Guru Dev. <laughs> Thank you, Guru Dev, for all your mercy, for your compassion and passion. <laughs> And I see Maharaj also great song. You see, I'm listening. It was so relishing. How the mercy. Life change our life. She is really nice. Change her life, whole family. This is the Krupa. We cannot do much. We have to live under the mercy of our spiritual master. Everything can be possible. I hate to give karma. If I do, and then I receive mercy, it is not mercy. Mercy means I do nothing much, but I got the special mercy. That is a hate to give karma. Rasa, Jananda Maharaj is very elevated so now. You cannot imagine his realization. <laughs> I'm telling you, if you want to check someone, you say, "Okay, give her enough." Guru, do like this. Then after her enough, how the change is power of the mantra change the life of others. When he is changing. Then the guru say, "Give the diksha now. Is changing or not? If the life not change, is no meaning for me. The even the master not realize how the disciple will realize. So you can imagine, he has so power that he can change the life of his children." 
what is happening to him, you realize? This is Huh? How much you grow, your life changing to others, I, our own, uh, myself, I am changing my life. To useful to the service for other one. This is the goal of our life. Thank you. Huh? I, I want to say something. Yes, Can no, I? my dear. You will I always want to say, but actually, when you not say, so I switch off my camera. No, actually, actually, Guru just stole my words. Like, I just felt, I just really want to share something about my dear Kalindi Didi, because our history goes long back. It starts actually, we were initiated at the same day, at the same time in Dole. And since then, uh, we have been. Uh, in service together for Guru Dev and Radha Mohan. And sometimes we struggle together. Sometimes we laugh together. Sometimes we even had arguments together. But, but there is nobody like her, really. Like what Guru Dev said, it so much resonates in our hearts that bringing the devotees together, taking that responsibility. You know, it's not an easy task. Most of us escape from that responsibility. We rather want to be ourselves in our four walls. But Kalindi always is the first to come to a festival. Even she would drive the whole way down to Italy just to come and see the devotees. And secondly, also Gurudev's uh, tour, you know, who has ever been with Gurudev or ever has seen a tour plan, it's not human. <laughs> not a human can do this tour and not a human can organize this tour. <laughs> and sometimes Kalindi was so clever that she immediately made the tour and Guru said, I will not travel this year or maybe I will make a draft. <laughs> and Kalindi next day had the draft ready of the program and tickets were already booked. So Guru had to come to Europe. Yeah. He had no choice. So already some years before he stopped traveling, he was already not wanting to travel, but because of Kalindi Didi, because of her cleverness, he had no choice. So we are very thankful, really. You cannot imagine what it means to bring Gurudev to Europe. It's not an easy task. And only she managed it because he loves Rindavan so much, but she managed it. And the other thing which Gurudev said is with the Prem Medical Seva, Gurudev already mentioned it, you know, like every day hundreds of patients are coming, you know, for treatment. And during Corona times, when nobody was allowed to run, Gurudev, in a clandestine way, mm -hmm. continued this service, you know. And Prem Prashad. Prem Prashad also. That, but it was amazing to see what happened in these times. And now, before, if you would ask a rickshawala anywhere in Vrindavan to bring you to Munger Mandir, he would say he doesn't know that place. But now... If you ask Mungir Mandir, you have seen, he said, yes, because of Prem Mate. They know where, the, where you get the free medicine, they say. And I say, yeah, that's where you get the free medicine. <laughs> so also bringing Radha Mohan into the spotlight of Vrindavan is also part of Prem Mate. So I, I just wanted to say this. Thank you, Didi. We love you, Didi. <laughs> Come soon. Come soon. We miss you. <laughs> Radhe, Radhe, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank Domina, you. Radhe, 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 thank you for your words. Yes, sometimes <laughs> we are quarreling. But what, what you say about, and also Guru Dev, about visiting the devotees, I tell you, this is just just selfish this is just because the devotees are so you're so dear to me you're, you're my life and my soul sometimes then i have to come to see you and you know all of you you know i like to travel and this is the best to travel and and to meet you and and sometimes i even feel oh my god now i'm going to disturb them again and but yeah then i think okay maybe they will accept me and and uh 
this is because it's just it's just for myself i'm sorry to say <laughs> You know, they're all our house. So now we would like to uh, invite our Ina, Ina, Bakhtin Ina from Russia. She has prepared to sing a song for all of us. Hare Krishna, my dear family. <laughs> Rade Rade. <laughs> Sadhu Maharaj, Sadhu Rade, all devotees. <laughs> I am so happy to see you <laughs> again. Uh, Govinda Mohini uh, said me today that uh, uh, she and her family, uh, he uh, was, uh, uh, he bought a new house in the south of our, uh, of, uh, of our country uh, in Russia, and they moved uh, three or four uh, day ago <laughs> days ago and that's why she, um the internet uh, is very bad uh, uh there um in this moment and uh, she warned me today that uh, maybe uh, she will not be able uh, to be in this meeting and to translate that's why <laughs> i that's why i i will try <laughs> to uh, tell myself about the song uh, that i um, has written uh, that I have written uh, in the spring, um, and this uh, song um, is dedicated to the Lord Krishna. The music uh, in this song is not mine. Uh, this music is uh, from uh, one uh, very uh, famous and uh, uh, beautiful Russian film, a film about uh, heroism and about love. Uh, but the music that was there. Uh, I like it so much that I decided uh, to um, to write lyrics uh, on this music and to sing these lyrics uh, to our Lord uh, for our Lord Krishna. And uh, I don't know um, if it does um, if it um, uh, has a sense uh, to I have I have translated uh, this uh, lyric this text uh, into English uh, only today, <laughs> and I have. Uh, and I didn't uh, have a time to um, translate into rhymes, uh, only <laughs> literally <laughs> without rhymes. And um, I don't know uh, how it will be better uh, if I will sing this song uh, only into English or into Russian and then into English. How do, what do you, uh, what do you think about it? Um, maybe it will be better that I first uh, that I first uh, say the translation of this song in English, and then I will sing. How do you think? What do you mean? Yes, what yes, you, you can do. You can do. Mm -hmm. okay. First English, and then sing. Okay, so uh, the translation of this song. Ah, like a life without a dream, a dream without love, and love without longing for you, my dear Shyam. So the years are empty without the right to love, without the right to fly to your call or to your glance beckoning or to your beckoning glance. And I, as in a blissful delirium, walk through all the trials to you, O oh my Lord. And even though I am a sinner, yet for you every silent moan of mine. The roads of love for you are not easy. Even though you are always here, you are calling, you are waiting for me. And my thoughts are full of happy longing, and people are generous. You lead me to you through them. The land where there are so many partings itself will suddenly push me to you because your mercy is without walls and without a bone. And I am just your speck of dust, my eternal friend. 
so was the translation. And if you allow me, I uh, maybe first I will sing this uh, song in uh, Russian um, with music and then in English. Uh, our, uh, does our time allow uh, us to do it? Uh, Inna, I think maybe only in your language what you feel best because we have one more person to share. That is Uda Vadas. Okay. So only in Russian, yes? Only in Russian, yes? Or I'm As you feel more happy. I can move to next week's meeting. So um, <laughs> I I can uh, do as you want Russian uh, to 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 uh, to sing on on Russian or <laughs> on English yeah. as you want. Sing in Russian, very good. In Russian. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Как жизнь без мечты, мечта без любви, любовь без тоски по тебе. Ож я мой родной, так годы пусты, без права любви. Лететь на призыв или взгляд, манящий твой, до годы пусты, без права любви. Лететь на призыв или взгляд, манящий твой. И я, как в блаженном приду, сквозь все испытания иду. К тебе, мой Господь, и грешная хоть, но все ж по тебе. Каждый стон безмолвный мог. Дороги любви тебе нелегки, Хоть ты всегда тут и зовешь, Ты ждешь меня. А мысли полны, счастливой тоски, И люди щедры через них. Идешь меня, и мысли полны, Счастливой тоски. А люди щебры через ты идешь меня. Земля, где так много разум, сама подтолкнет к тебе друг. Ведь милость твоя Исчезнет и без дна А я лишь пылинка твоя Мой вечный друг Thank you very much, Ina. We are very impressed uh, about your artistic talents. That must be the mercy of Shrimati Radhika that you can sing so nicely. All glory to our Swamini.
Shri Mati Lam Ratharani. Jai, Jai Shri Radhe. Well, Thank you. Strong. Thank you also for your... The, you have so much uh, courage to, to sing and to speak. And um, I hope I will listen more from you and your life story. When also Govinda Mohini and um, Nandarani are there with you, you said you like to have their support. Thank you. Thank you so much for your sharing and welcome to our family. Hare Krishna. Radhe Radhe. Thank you. <laughs> now I would like to welcome also our dear Udavji. He is in Paris, right? Are you now in Paris, Udavji? Radhe Radhe. Yes, I'm in Paris. <laughs> Mm, hello, everybody. Nanavataranam. So nice to see you. I've so enjoyed these these meetings. Uh, Suniti asked me to to speak, and that's very, very, very nice. And then I wonder what I should say. <laughs> um, and I think uh, I've been inspired by many things said recently in our group. And one thing that really touched me was. Uh, what we talked about last week in the German Sangha, at the very end, when Gurudev said to Raghunathas to read from Radharasa Sudhaniti 217, if you weren't there, it's, I can recommend it. And it really uh, inspired me in thinking about maybe the biggest mystery of of what we do and our relationship to, to Gurudev. And that's um, this sort of fight between thinking and loving, between uh, thought and, and love. Of course, Gurudev tells us, reminds us often that the point is not philosophy, it's not to make theories, it's not to collect knowledge, it's not to read books. It's to learn how to love, and in particular, to learn how to love divinely. And, um, the last time I spoke, I told you the story about when I rediscovered divine love and finding some old letters, and I started crying, and, and I came to Gurudev, and he said, this is the love of Radhika. Congratulations, I'm so proud of you. Now you must write. <laughs> now you must write, he said. You must write this and share it with others. And it reminded me when he said how proud he was of my Yoga Shakti from last week, when it was, it was such a moving, a moving story that, uh, that you told, and Gurudev said the same. And I think it was very much like mine that there was some sort of opening to a, a, a deeper love that was already there. And then on this Aradarasa Sudhaniti 217, there's this wonderful, uh, very short uh, line, I, I opened it up this morning, where it says, uh, what do you want to have holy books for when you, uh, even if they're followed by great saints, if they don't bring you the nectar? Basically, this is what it says. You don't need the holy books. So this has really been my challenge, and I wonder if it's a challenge for, for you too. That's why I, I bring it up. Uh, Gurudev says that love is the goal. Divine love is the goal. Uh, Radhika's love is the goal. And so how do we make that love bigger? How do we cultivate it? How do we support it? And for Gurudev, of course, he supports it by taking the identity of Guru Mantari. And then we as Acharyas and we as devotees, we support Guru Dev in, in doing this, by helping him go deeper. And then the very wise ones amongst, amongst us, like, like Jainanda uh, uh, Maharaj or Tarun Baba or many others can help us to go deeper. And then what about we devotees, we simple devotees? Um, our job is to cultivate divine love in our everyday lives. And uh, Jainanda Maharaj said something very nice about this a couple of weeks ago when someone asked how we, how we do this. And he said, 
you find divine love in making your bed and in washing your dishes and taking your children to the school. This is where you find it and you see signs of it and you find it in strangers. One of my favorite uh, games to play when I'm walking in the busy streets in Paris is to look at strange people and see the divine in them. And if you just look at them for a moment, you can see their life, you can see God in them, you can see the divine love. Maybe it's covered up by tiredness or anger or frustration, but it's in everyone and it shines, they can't even hide it. It's just a, a miracle. So it's a funny problem for me because you, you maybe know that I'm actually a professor at the university. And even worse, I'm a professor of philosophy. And it's, of course, the thing I need last in being a good, uh, good bhakta. And this is the thing that comes up every time I talk with my dear Gurudev, that uh, what I need to do is find, find the love. And he even gave me the blessed name of Uddhava. And of course, you know that Uddhava was a philosopher. And he was the very good friend and close counselor of Krishna. And then at the end of Krishna's stay in, in, in the world, it's in the last book, of, or sorry, the 11th book of uh, Bhagavatam, then Krishna instructs him about spiritual life and tells him everything he needs to know to stop being a philosopher and become a, a fully spiritual, fully spiritual person. So I was really, uh, for many years, since when I took Diksha, it was um, six years ago, I've struggled with this, how to use my talents, my skills to serve God and to create divine love. And now in my writing and in my thinking, I've realized that it is in the it is in the books and the pictures and the people where we find beautiful things. And these beautiful things, that's where divine love shows itself. When we see beauty, just in a moment of a song like the one we just heard, or a poem, or maybe in a picture, or maybe in a smell of food or something else. This is divine love trying to find its way out. Because we block it, we block it with our with our minds, with our, our intellects, it's already in there in us. Just like it was already in there in my yoga Shakti last week, and, and she just opened the gate and, and the divine love, love came out like this. And that's how it was when I had my experience a few months back with, with uh, Gurudev. So our task as devotees, I think, is to, to unblock, to unblock it. And this is the words that Gurudev says always. In this verse that we talked about last week, it says that uh, Radhika is everywhere. And Radhika's love is everywhere. Every time you see a bird singing or you hear a lovely note of music, this is Radhika's love. So we need to, I need to, we need to, Listen to this, listen to it, uh, feel it. So I have a little experience of divine love, we all do. And, uh, and our goal is to make this bigger. And when uh, Gurudev talks about the flow, he means the flow of divine love through us, between us, to other people. And that's what I'm trying to do, that's my goal and I have a long, long path ahead. But I think it's the goal that uh, we all share, actually, in, in our different ways of living in the world, living with other people. It's a matter of opening, opening up those gates and finding the Radhika in us and letting her flow into, into others. Yeah, that is it. Very nice. Come on, over. Right.
Ale on ma piska i... Oh, thank you so much, Udafji. I remember last time when we met in Vrindavan, your depth and your depth of feeling. And uh, <clears throat> I find it amazing that you come uh, with this background into bhakti because often it is not possible for the those who are so much into philosophy, like you said. And Gurudev is always giving us this advice to forget our knowledge and come into the feeling because Radharani is only feelings, so how to connect with the feelings? Maybe Gopinath, you want to share something? How you met Udavji? They are in meetings. No, oh, they are already in meetings. Around yes, started also. Okay. But Udav. Uh, 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 is a guide of uh, Gopika. He is, he is by Uddhav help, she become peers. Yeah, that's Gopika. how I met you today. Yes. Uh, Gopika uh, was my student. Yeah. And now I'm her student, you see. A boy, you know. Now Nina Boy was, uh, he's a student. Nina Boy, yes. Gopika. Do you know Nina Boy, Suniti, right? Yes, Gurudev, I was in contact with her. She will also come to Munge Mandir. She wants to come in February, March. Uh, see, she oh, should nice. come now. Uddhav is also coming now. <laughs> yes, I come in January. Uh, Jai Ho! Jai Ho! Uh, So that's that's yeah. so Gopika was nice. Yes, Sorry. Jainanda Maharaj is also coming, so we will be very happy at your lotus feet of Radha Mahan's lotus feet yeah. and uh, swinging in the love <laughs> Lovely. of Radhika. Hmm. Very nice. All is to help myself first. Jive Daya. When I can see myself, I can help others. Many people help others without understanding themselves. When I don't understand that I am a jiva, how I can help the other jiva? Jiva is there. We have to understand that we are all jiva is sarupoy krishna nityadas. We are the always his servant. <laughs> Thank you for today meeting. Thank Jai you, Gurudev. Thank you, all Vaishnavas. Gurudev. How long has he been into spiritual introduction? Six years. He got an addiction six years ago. Oh, wow. Yeah. So a student. One of his philosophy students. Yeah. Gopika. It's Gopinath's wife. <laughs> you can hear me. <laughs> Jai Jagatam. <laughs> Jai Jagatam, Didi. Jai. 
my friend was asking me about Uddhava and uh, how he came. I was just explaining how um, Gopika was his student. Now she, he is her student. <laughs> <laughs> Jai Gurudev, Jai, all the assembled devotees. It's so wonderful to be with you all. Yeah. I, I remind me, I see, I was in Miami, I see one Prabhupada video. He is talking on that, at the time of his, uh, Bhyas Puja of his Guru there. He said that, you are all my Gurudev expansion, mm -hmm. Prabhupada. So you all join to help what is the mission of the Gurudev. So we are all brother and sister to serve to Gurudev. And we are and you are helping me that I can do for my Guru Dev something. It was so much touch, and every devotees are crying by listening to Prabhupada, and he is also full of tears. And wow, he's so full of love. <coughs> I see he's around about 10 years before in Miami. The devotees, when, God, when Prabhupada said that um, you have all been sent to me by my Gurudev, the devotees asked him, but why we were, why were we born in the West? Why were we born into meat-eating families? And Prabhupada said, just so I will come to the West and spread this Krishna consciousness on the order of my Guru Day. Jai, oh, Jai Prabhupada. Well, thank you. 